Hi students, welcome to English 100. I'm going to be your instructor for the spring 2020 semester. My name is Jessica Bowamini. Uh, I really look forward to getting to know each and every one of you, reading all of your work, um, and just helping you guys progress as readers and writers this semester. So I'm going to do a quick little overview of the course and the Canvas shell, um, and then some of the first kind of things that you need to know starting week one. So let me switch to the course page. So here is our Canvas homepage. Um, as you can see, right front and center is my email. I will respond to this email within 24 hours. Uh, you can also contact me through Canvas, through the inbox. Um, so either one or both, whatever works for you is fine. Um, if you want to schedule an appointment with me for kind of like a virtual office hour, um, just let me know. Again, just email me. We can figure out a way to do that, whether it's Google Hangout or Skype or FaceTime, whichever works. There's a little bit of information about difficulties with Canvas, so if you need help, um, some student support services down below. Uh, it's also available up in this tab here, um, just so you know. On the right is all of the upcoming assignments, so, you know, it's a good way to keep track of things that are going on. If I were you, I'd also download the Canvas app. It can be really helpful on your smartphone. Um, so there is the course syllabus here. I'm going to go over that in a second. And then this is the most important tab, which is the modules tab. So I'm going to click on that. So I've already laid out the first four weeks of the course. So you kind of know what's coming up, how to get prepared and plan ahead. Um, so go ahead and look that over. Um, one important thing I wanted to bring up with you guys, and this is really cool, is Microsoft Word offers free Office Suite to people that have a valid student email address. So um, I highly prefer... Uh, Microsoft Word to Google Docs. It's just a little bit easier to use. There's more features. So I would highly suggest to do this. Plus, it's free. So take advantage of perks of being a student while you can. <laughs> um, so uh, another important thing here is the course syllabus. So I'm just going to click on that really quick. I do want you to thoroughly read this um, within the first week. So you kind of know it is basically our contract for the course. Uh, let me pull it up. Um, so again, my email's here, a um, little bit of information. Uh, the two books we're reading are The Other Westmore and The Sun Does Shine. All other texts will be provided through Canvas. I will let you know what you need to read and when, of course. Um, here's all the course requirements, information about points, basic stuff. Here's the breakdown of grades. Um, and then at the very end is the course schedule, which of course are tentative and always subject to change. Um, I usually don't stray from it unless, you know, students need a little bit more time with something. Of course that happens. So, um, but I will let you know always if I ever decide to change dates on anything. Um, doesn't happen that often, but. And just also a heads up, um, within the first week, I am expecting students to be logging in regularly and I can tell who's logging in and for how long. So. Um, I do this because the wait list for this class is very long and so if students aren't checking in within the first week um, and they don't let me know why, um, I do tend to drop students. I will always email you before though to, you know, just check in. Um, but just, you know, keep in contact with me, let me know what's going on. Um, you do need to complete the honesty pledge and the qu syllabus quiz by the 16th, so that would be um, basically midnight, um, before midnight on the 16th. So before Friday morning, basically. So get those done. Students who do not complete these and do not let me know, unfortunately, I will, um, likely drop them, um, if they don't contact me, of course. So anyway, just, so just things to look out for. Um, anyway, it's been really good, uh, introducing myself. I can't wait to get to know you guys and I hope you have a very successful semester. All right. Bye.